Hey guys, today I am answering a uh, Dolly vlog hop question. This is a question that I, it was actually, I'm, I've wanted to answer it for a while, so check out the other um, vloggers to uh, check out their answers. So the question is this, what advice do you give people who, when someone says you're weird for playing with dolls or you're too old to play with dolls? And I've been thinking about it for a while, to share about it. And it's related to this fantastic 50s diner set that you see here. Um, so this was 1988 and I was starting high school. So I was 13, 14. And I remember it was Christmas time. And my sister, who is four years younger than me, uh, we were both, you know, my mom was like, what do you want for Christmas? And um, all I wanted that year for Christmas was this. <laughs> I saw the commercial like on Saturday morning with cartoons and it's called Dixie's Diner and it was this adorable little toy set and the bottom of the floor is made with metal, the little dolls have magnets in their feet and it comes with all these like miniature little little pieces that you know when finished uh, create this awesome little diner. I was obsessed, okay? I went to the toy store. I'm like, I gotta have this. And so that Christmas, my mom, who is the bomb, okay? She got me almost all of it. And my sister wanted clothes and shoes and like purses and like some makeup. She was, she was a very glamorous kid. And um, I remember sitting on the floor with my mom on Christmas day and we're putting this together, my mom's putting stickers on it, and my sister is sitting up on the bed, surrounded by her fabulous clothes and shoes and all her, everything that she wanted she got. And I remember feeling her look down at me and she goes, you're weird, aren't you like too old to play with dolls? And I, I'm sure I said something like, dear sister, I will, no, I'm sure I said something like, shut up or much worse. But I will tell you something that it was a, one of those transition times in life and I did think for a second, oh my gosh, she's right, I'm, I'm a weirdo. I'm, I'm 14 years old and I'm sitting here playing with toys with my mom. I'm, I'm very weird. I am way too old to be doing this. And I'll tell you that from that point on, I started to hide um, my love of toys and that extended well into my 20s. So yes, did I accidentally pass by the toy aisle when I went into stores? Did I start collecting toys that were small so I could hide them? Yes, that's kind of sad. But you do think when you're going through these periods of life that maybe there's something wrong with me or maybe I'm immature or you know, th this is not where I should be spending my money. And so the advice that I would give to someone who is in that position is, yeah, you're weird, all right. You're, you're fantastically, wonderfully weird. And there are so many other people just like you, one is right here, who support that. Um, that being said, I know that it's sometimes tough whenever you are around people, your friends, maybe your significant other, your parents, who are not as supportive, and I get that. And sometimes you do have to just accept that people aren't always going to understand um, your love of toys, but it shouldn't be a deterrent for you to explore something that you really love. So that's the advice that I would give someone who feels that they're weird or too old for toys. You're never too old. Thanks.